here. As you inhale, sweep the arms up, release. Do this two more times. Inhale, lift up. One more. Inhale, reach up. And reach your left fingertips over to the right side. Bring your chest up to the sky. Inhale, push into the right hand. Reach both arms up overhead. Down neck to the left hip. Right fingertips reach over to the left side. Push the fingers away and reach the left ear down towards the left shoulder for a neck stretch. Inhale. Exhale. All fours. Tabletop position. Shoulders over wrists, hips over knees. Inhale, look forward. Lift the hips up. And then as you exhale, push them up. Inhale, lift the hips. Heart reaches forward between the arms. Exhale, round the back. Last time, inhale, forward. Exhale around. It's neutral. From here, left toes reach back. Straighten the left leg. Press the toes into the mat behind you. Take your left hand to your left hip and spin your chest open to the left. Spin onto the inside of the left foot. Good. Now from here, press down to lift your hips up and spin your chest even more up towards the sky. And then maybe if you feel steady and comfortable, you can also raise the left arm up. Maybe take the left leg up as well. Whoa. <laughs> take one more breath in. Spin your chest up and open so our whole front body is exposed. Take one round of cat cow. Drop the belly, lift the hips, reach the heart forward. Inhale. And exhale, round the back. Inhale it to neutral. Same thing, other side. Straighten the right leg back behind you. Come onto your toes. And then kickstand your left foot out to the left side of the mat. Press into the left hand and spin your chest up and open to the right. Right hand to the right hip. And then lift the hips up and see how much of your left rib cage you can spiral up towards the sky. Maybe reach the right fingertips up. And then if you feel stable and sturdy, Lift the right leg. Inhale here, relax your face. One cat cow, drop the belly, lift the hips, reach the heart forward, in. and exhale round. Come back to neutral, tuck your toes under, lift your hips, and come into downward dog. Pull your sit bones straight up towards the sky. Your heels go to the left, and see if you can sit back onto your left heel. Huge side body stretch on the right. Inhale, lift the sit bones straight up to the sky, come back to center. And as you exhale, pivot your toes to the left, heels to the right, bend your knees, sit back towards the right heel. Inhale, back to center, one more time each side. Spin the knees to the right. And then as you exhale, lean to the left. Again, just like we were before, spin your left ribs up as much as you can to open your entire front body. And then exhale, sink a little bit deeper. One more time. Inhale, lean. Exhale. Inhale, both arms up, come back to center. And then exhale. Hands down, cross your ankles, roll over your feet, and lay down. You might already feel the lengthening in your left side body. And then from here, we're gonna go even deeper. So, take your hands and your shoulders over to the right. Ah. And then close your eyes and we'll stay here for a couple of breaths. And this one is <laughs> lovingly called Bananasana. I think it makes a lot of sense. Take another inhale. Exhale. And then as you inhale, bring the shoulders and arms back to center. Uncross the legs. I always love to chart the after effects of the practice. This always makes it so worth it. So on days when I don't feel like practicing yoga, I think, oh yeah, remember last time? At the end of the practice when I thought, ooh, I'm so glad that I practiced that day. And then bring your hands in front of your heart. Press your palms together. And lift your head up. Open your eyes. Thank you so much for practicing with me. And I'll see you again tomorrow. Namaste.